So here I have the result of the winter sowing of sweet peas. Looks like I have five here. And they're going to go in this raised bed in the flower garden. And I have, as you can see, a trellis here. So hopefully they will grow up the trellis. That's the plan anyway. We'll see what happens. And it should get enough sunlight without being blocked by this massive hollyhock. That's the plan. So I thought that I would show you what I got from the rest of my winter sowing. Uh, it's all been sitting here on the south side of my potting shed. And um, I've just taken the tape off, but we're going to see what's inside. This one is a scabiosa. I want to say it says Fifi, but I'm not sure. It doesn't sound right. But uh, that one did really good. Germinated. Fantastic. Um, couldn't ask for better than that. But then this one is a Cosmos. I can't read the name on it. Magic marker did not last. And unfortunately, Zilch. Which is really disappointing. Um... I'm not sure if it got too dry or what exactly the problem was there. It was given the same moisture as everybody else, but he didn't do so well. Now the Cosmos next to him, one. So maybe Cosmos is not a good candidate for winter sowing. That may very well be. This is my first time ever doing it, but um, yeah, that, that's not so uh, great either. See, this one is Scabiosa. Again, one. Same conditions. I don't know what happened here. <laughs> okay, another Cosmos. Let's see what happened. Another one, but a big one. So. I think next year I'm not going to try Cosmos anymore. <laughs> we'll plant these guys out and uh, plant the rest of the seeds that were in the pack. This one is also Scabiosa. I want to say this is Black Knight. And this one did well. This one is okay. So Scabiosa, two out of three. Good odds, I guess. Uh, this is a larkspur. Oops, let me take the tape off here. Right Let's see what you have. Come on. Come on. Uh, one. <laughs> one larkspur. Oh, oh, oh. Okay. Now, snapdragons. Now, I tried snapdragons last year, direct sewing, and in a tray in my laundry room. Uh, direct sewing did not germinate at all and the tray in my laundry room I got a few but as soon as I transplanted them out they just bit the dust so this one it's kind of weird I've got a great big one and three middle sizes and a tiny baby but we'll plant them out this one is the universal mix snapdragon universal um, fantastic I'm so happy. I can't wait to have snapdragons. I love them. And the one that I tried last year and that I'm so looking forward to this year, snapdragon ap Potomac apple blossom, one. One measly little bent over even. So another failure with that one. Maybe I'm just not meant to have that particular kind because these guys are good. But anyway, uh, that's the winter sowing results.